Wednesday evening, got a bit of hair in my eye. <laughs> How are you doing? I've decided to do the whole 30 elimination diet thing. I tried it a couple of years ago and I failed miserably, but I feel like uh, I really am giving it a better go this time around. So I have, I noticed today I left drinking coffee until four o'clock in the afternoon and I noticed that it worked out really well really really well for my energy levels I seem to um, still feeling the effects and it's way gone in the evening right now so laundry has been folded and put away the day is done and I feel like tomorrow I'm going to just push the coffee drinking even further. I'm just going to try and push it and push it until I can just maybe just slide it off the edge completely and just maybe quit. I'm not, I do not have high hopes for that. I'm able to do, you know, I, I, I didn't drink coffee for over 30 days for Lent. I didn't do the whole 40 days for nativity lent but I did 30 odd but the taste and the smell got to me like a couple of days ago when I made some it was just so lovely so lovely but it's the same sort of lovely that sugar is for me so I have to be so careful about these things because otherwise what I do is when I feel like I'm a little bit pinched like, you know, I've got loads to do and time's running out and all the rest of it. I'll go and have sugar and I really, really don't like that. I'm also a bit of an emotional sh eater and sugar crave. I crave sugar when I'm a bit stressed out. So I don't, I, I really feel like if I did this elimination diet, it would be a good thing. Does anyone want to do it with me? <laughs> or, or have you done it? Have you done it before? I'm not a huge meat eater, so it's probably gonna bend more on the uh, vegetarian side of things, but I do like meat. I just can't eat it more than, I don't know, once a week. I can't eat it for a lot, I don't know. I used to, I worked and lived on an organic meat farm years ago, yeah? And every lunchtime, it was compulsory that we had lunch together and they fed us obviously meat. And it was like the best quality meat. But after about a month of having the steady diet of being heavily, heavily meat based, my nails, I started to get massive white lines in my nails, like I was starting to get deficient because I wasn't having anything green <laughs> and so I know that personally I, I do like vegetables more than I like meat but I'll see how I go I'm just chatting away now so I do hope you're well I hope your week is going well uh, tomorrow is Thursday whoops a couple of hours it'll be Thursday 
And I was thinking, when I used to work in a secondary school, just when I met my husband, I was working in a secondary school as a, a learning support assistant. And if you've ever worked in a school, I don't know, maybe this is just like in the context of a London school, I don't know, but everyone used to get so excited on Thursday. And I remember one of the science teachers, the chemistry teacher, always said, the weekend starts on Thursday. <laughs> Because he used to just come in and be bagged on a Friday, but no one cared on a Friday because it was Friday. So for him, uh, the weekend always started on a Thursday, and I always remember that. <laughs> it's funny what we choose to hang on to. It's funny how many people used to be in my life. I used to just be, I used to just speak and see people from the moment I got up to the moment I went to sleep. And I'm not gonna lie, I really used to like it. And it is a little bit weird now where things are just socially off. And it's strange. I mean, I actually do love living where I live because I do, because we have shared laundry and it's outside of our apartment. I see our neighbors when I'm popping in and out. I do laundry all the live long day, most of the week. And I just saw one of my neighbours tonight, she's ever so sweet. And she said, you know, there's such a lovely community here and it's so nice when we see you popping out to do the laundry. Because, you know, I'm like, yeah, human connection. She's like, yes, human connection. It's just so nice to see people in the flesh. And I am very grateful for YouTube because seeing people in the flesh has been diluted massively. God bless. I hope you are well. And I will speak to you very, very, very soon. Good night. Bye.